subscribe to my channel by reading the title to obviously tell what video I'm doing today. Today I'll be doing a lip gloss collection video because I've been seeing this video idea going around YouTube. So I planned, I, I can't mistake. But yeah, I found that video really interesting and I have a lot of lip glosses. So I wanted to do it. So we're going to do it today. But yeah, let's get right into the... Alright, so to start off, all my lip glosses are in this bag. It's an Ipsy bag. If you don't know what Ipsy is, it's one of those monthly subscription makeup makeup websites. You pay $10 a month for it. I make up bag. But yeah, the bag is cute. Has a witch on it, a ghost, lipstick, a spell book, a Ouija board, a magic potion, a cat, and yeah. Let's get started. Alright, first lip gloss I have in here is... It's by the Broadway, the Broadway company or whatever. It's the RK by Kiss Jelly Lipsies Lip Gloss. You can find this one at your local hair store. This is really nice. It's not that sticky either. Next, I have another one by the Broadway company. I have the Coconut Oil. This is I like this one. It's my favorite. It's not too thick. It's not too sticky. I have two of those. I had to re-up on the old one. Oh, shoot. I had to re-up on the old one because this one's almost done. And next, I have these two right here from the dollar store. It's really pretty. I like the packaging. It's like cute. It's simple. Cute. And these are really nice. And they're not too glossy, not too watery. I honestly need to stop. I don't know what's wrong with me. Like really I like the little brush. The lid looks like this. It's just white. I like the little sound it makes when you open it. Next, I have BTW. By the way, this is not just only lip gloss. I have chapstick and car mix and stuff in here. First, I have my Birds and Bees Flavor Crystals Lip Balm in a flavor of lip orange. It's 100% natural. It looks like this. This is the cap, but you just take it off like that. And it's a twist up. And it smells really bad, but it's really good for your lips. And this one was like... $3.99. I got this at Burlington. Or you could get it from Walmart. Next, I have my two eggs in here. As I my two eggs, I have my two EOSs. I'm gonna start with this one. This is the lavender flavored EOS. I had this one for a while. It's like pink, no, like lavender purple or like lilac. The cap looks like this. And it's very used out. So next one I have is the clear eels in this pink little egg. Looks like this. It's clear. It's well used out too. Cap looks like this. This one's kind of broken. I've had it for a while, and I've been through like World War. Alright, next lip gloss we have in here is my RK by Kiss Hydrating Lip Oil Treatment. This one smells really good and it has like that peppermint flavor to it. No, I don't eat it. You just like when you put it on your lips, you can smell it and like sometimes you lick your lips and you can taste it. Next, I have my classic lip balm, Medicated Carmex. It's the little twist up version. And this one I got from the dollar store. Next, I have my vanilla orchard flavored gloss. It's the Victoria's Secret Bombshell collection. Looks like this. When you open it, 
the colors come out like this. Oh shoot, the camera's over here. The colors come out like that. But one thing I don't like about Victoria's Secret's lip gloss, it's very like sticky and thick and like it's glossy but it's too like when you put it on your lips stick together and it oh this gets me then we have another medicated ch chapstick i took the paper off of this but i best believe this is this is bliss text this is bliss text and this leaves my my lips like moisturized like you know when your lips like get all dried out and like cracking sh stuff Nope, not all chapstick do that. Yes, it does. That's why it's chapstick. Since stuff will still be there. You guys, yeah, use you it. Oh, no. What is it? Happy. Want to know what lip gloss I have on? I have on this one. All right. Last but not least, I have the Maybelline New York. Um, lip gloss slash chapsticky. Before when I first got it, I used to think it up like twist it off, cause you see how it looks like lipstick right there, but that's not. That's like the lip gloss on the inside. When you open it, it looks like this. Looks like that, and it smells really good. I like the brush. Looks like this. It's really pink. But yeah, that's the end of this video. Y'all wanna see all my lip glosses? Oh, lip glosses. This is the lip glosses. Shoot, there's hair. Glosses. Um, let's recreate another thumbnail, I guess. This is how it looks brand new. Compared to the open one. The open one looks like the open one. Hold on, give me a second. Open one looks like this with all these bubbles. Closed one looks like this. It looks so nice and pretty. And there's no bubbles except for that one right here. But otherwise, this lip gloss is really good too. And it's only a dollar. And they have other ones. But I like this one the most. But yeah, that's all my lip glosses. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe if you're new to my channel. I hope you check out my most recent video, which is my what's on my iPhone and my iPhone 8 Plus case collection video. And I hope you guys liked all my glosses and chapsticks. And I hope I can put you guys on to some new chapsticks to use. But yeah, that's the end of this video. That lip gloss is a girl's best friend. I don't know what's wrong with you. Cause like, <sighs> lip gloss becoming a clutch, period. This hydrating lip oil was like a dollar ninety nine, and it it was a good two dollar buy. Uh, look at that! Like, look at the lips like pop, and I love the tube. Just love that tube.